In this video, I'm going to have a look at setting up Windows 11 24H2 with a local account. So when you connect to the internet, um, Microsoft is going to try and strong arm you into um, signing in with a Microsoft account. So when we go to next, it's going to check for updates. Prompt you to input your computer name. Reboot. And then you'll have this option set up for personal use. And then in the next screen, um, when you select sign in, it's only going to offer you to sign in with a Microsoft account. So if I have a look at the other options in the screen, I've got a limited number of accessibility settings. And if I tried the old trick of signing in with a known account that's been overused with the wrong password, I get the, oops, something went wrong. But then it just instructs me to sign in with a Microsoft account again. So this old trick no longer works. So what I'm going to do is press Shift and F10. And this is going to open up the command prompt. So at this stage, the, the system will, will flash and you'll essentially be taken to a temporary uh, local account. So if I select these options now, it actually opens up settings. And if I go to network and internet, I can turn off my Wi-Fi. So now I can press Shift and F10 to open up the command prompt and I'm going to type in OOBE out of the box experience, bypass the network requirement option. So when I type this command, the system is going to reboot. So we'll be back to the start of the out of the box experience. And here we have the option, I don't have internet and we can just sign in with a local account and we can go ahead and finish the setup. So now I'll be taken to the Windows 11 desktop and I'm still going to be offline um, because the wireless network's disabled. So if I go to settings and network and internet, I can enable the wireless card. And that's Windows 11 24H2 with a local account.